The size of the quantum dots are typically about 10 nanometers or even less, and this is one millionth of a centimeter. Or you can think about that it's 10,000 times smaller than the width of a human hair. Why quantum? So when we're having particles that small, now we have this very interesting ability to virtually touch an electron cloud. So we can squeeze it or we can expand it. And in this way, of course, we can modify properties of the material in very dramatic ways. So you have now the ability to control the properties of matter at a very fundamental level, quantum mechanical level. Therefore, we call them quantum dots. So our nation needs new materials, materials to produce energy, materials to store energy, materials uh, which can be effective light emitters for solid state lighting, materials which can be extremely sensitive to detect chemical threats, uh, to detect radiation. Um, and quantum dots can help us in all of these areas. You can make red light with larger particles, you can make blue light with the smaller particles. Okay, that's why quantum dots are now being used in commercial display technologies. You can buy TV sets, uh, which are powered by the quantum dots. You can reduce the cost of solar electricity, supplementing solar cells with large area sunlight collectors, which utilize highly luminescent quantum dots. And you can think about new applications of photovoltaic devices in the form of solar or photovoltaic windows. So you can turn uh, your office window of your home window into a power generation unit. You can think about launching these devices, this large area sunlight collector, the solar wings into space to power spacecraft and satellites. Okay, they are interesting for lasing applications. Of course, there are plenty of materials for lasers these days, but imagine you can assemble your laser on your table in a beaker from solution. So it opens completely new opportunities. You can now add your lasers to the products you never thought of. I have been working with quantum dots for a long time, 25 years. And what is interesting, every year is getting just more exciting. Mm -hmm.